students uh, welcome back let us continue the ne next example for the sequence container so in the previous video i i'll explain the example of the vector so with the program now let us discuss about the dq the example for the sequence container is the dq so what is this dq dq is nothing but it is a double ended double ended q it allows the main use of this dq is it allows fast insertion and deletion at both ends both ends of the q so double uh, dq is nothing but the insertion and deletion will be take place at both the end of uh, end of the q the syntax for this dq is dq object type dq name the functions of this dq are so functions are pushback push friend so i said uh, the insertion and deletion can be take place at both the ends of the queue so uh, the functions you can use a push back or push friend and insert pop back the deletion is also you can take it back side or front side pop front empty size swap so these are the different functions that can operate on the dq so let me take one example for this dq i'll explain about this dq with the program so the pop back removes an element from the back of the dq whereas a pop front removes an element from the front of the dq so if you use this thing both decreasing the size of the dq by 1 so whatever the operation you have taken uh, that will decrease the size of the queue the pop back and pop front can decrease the size of the dq so in the previous vector i had just seen the push now in dq i'll take the example for the pop so instead of push i'll take the pop example so for popping means if you can you can do at the back and you can do at the front so whatever you done the size will be decreasing hash include i was stream hash include dq so you have to take the container dq also that will be included in the library function and uh, along with this you can also write the vector also because you are using the array concept so include the vector int main okay now first take an array int array with some elements i'm taking 1 5 8 9 3 5 6 4 so these are the elements i had taken now i want to create a dq the syntax you write dq that uh, dq type whatever the elements that i am inserting that was an integer type int and uh, here you have to write the dq name i am taking as dq a comma a plus 8 total you are having eight elements so a comma a plus 8 so what it indicates it creates dq with elements 1 5 8 9 3 5 6 4 okay now the dq is this thing so it uh, the dq contains these elements now i want to pop friend dq dot pop friend so what it indicates pop friend means now my dq it's the name of the q dq is 
फाइव एट नाइन थ्री फाइव सिक्स फोर सो द फर्स्ट एलिमेंट द फ्रंट एलिमेंट इज पॉप्ड दैट विल बी प्रिंट ऑन द स्क्रीन सो दिस इज एन एग्जाम्पल ऑफ द डी क्यू सो द एलिमेंट कैन बी डिलीटेड एट द बैक और यू कैन डिलीटेड एट द फ्रंट सो वट इज द नेक्स्ट एग्जाम्पल फॉर द सीक्वेंस कंटेनर सो द नेक्स्ट एग्जाम्पल इज द लिस्ट लेट मी एक्सप्लेन अबाउट द लिस्ट देन एग्जाम्पल फॉर द सीक्वेंस कंटेनर सो द कंटेनर्स द स्टैंडर्ड टेम्पलेट लाइब्ररी कंटेन्स फोर कंटेनर्स सीक्वेंस कंटेनर एसोसिएटिव कंटेनर अनऑर्डर्ड एसोसिएटिव कंटेनर एंड द अडेप्टर्स ना आई एम डिस्कसिंग अबउट द फर्स्ट वन इज द सीक्वेंस कंटेनर सो आई एक्सप्लेन अबउट द वेक्टर एंड डी क्यू टू एग्जाम्पल्स फॉर द सीक्वेंस कंटेनर एंड द थर्ड वन इज द लिस्ट सो लिस्ट इज अ ट्रेडिशनली डबल लिंक सो एक्चुअली द लिस्ट इज नथिंग बट इट ट्रेडिशनली doubly linked list so don't expect random access here because it is a double linked list don't accept random access you can insert anywhere so the syntax for this uh, list is so if you take an example for this syntax creating a new linked list using list template okay so the syntax for this is hash include i was stream hash include so you have to include the list library function so that you can access list in the program int main so std is a base class std list so the list contains the integer values int l is the name of that list so what it does it creates a new empty list empty linked list l so this is the syntax of this linked list so the functions for this linked list or list or just like the uh, vector and the dq you are having the push back push back push front pop back pop front mm, next uh, like empty reverse size reverse sort so these are the different functions that you can use in the link list so in the previous uh, examples for the vector sequence uh, container and the dq sequence container for vector i explained i taken the example for the push and for dq i had taken the pop now let me for the list i'll explain the example for the function reverse so reverse let me write the program for this reverse hash include i was stream so we are using the list element so you have to write, include it in the library function hash include list int main now i want to reverse the whatever the list array that has to be reversed list int l is the name of the list this list contains the values 1 2 3 4 5 so that values i have to reverse so if you want to reverse these elements just write l dot reverse that's it l dot reverse 
so then it reverse your elements now the list becomes 5 4 3 2 1 okay so this is a program now, now the previously the list is like this sorry this is the list not there so first 1 2 3 4 5 so now the list is becomes reverse 5 4 3 2 1 so this will be reverse it's a list so this is a three examples for the sequence container so one is a vector sequence container dq sequence container and the list sequence container so in the next video i'll explain about the associative and unordered associative containers thank you